Hello everyone, you are welcome. How to solve and find the value of this interesting division exponential math problem, which is 40 raised to power 80 divided by 80 raised to power 40. So here I will try to solve this problem using two different methods. In the first method, I will try to make the power same. And in the second method, I will try to make the basis same in the numerator and denominator. So how can we solve this problem using the first method? So here in the first method, I will try to make this power and this power the same. So here I will try to make 40 in the power in both the numerator and denominator. So for that, we can write the numerator of this equation as this is 40 raised to power 80. But we can write this 80 as 40 plus 40 divided by 80 raised to power 40. Now here in the numerator of this equation, this number, we will use an exponential identity. So here in this numerator, we will use this one exponential identity. It is to power m plus n, which can also be written as r is to power m times r is to power n. Now using this exponential identity here, yeah, we can write this numerator as numerator will become 40 raised to power 40 times 40 raised to power 40 divided by denominator will be the same 80 raised to power 40. And next we can also write this number as 40 raised to power 40 divided by 80 raised to power 40 times this one number 40 raised to power 40 now by just look to the number in the left hand side this one number here both the number in numerator and denominator has the same power so here we will use the same power exponential identity so we will use this one identity here in this one number a raised to power n divided by b raised to power n which can also be written as a by b whole to power n. Now using this exponential identity, we can write this number as this will become 40 divided by 80 whole to power 40 times 40 to power 40. And we'll simplify these two numbers. 40 times 1 is 40, 40 times 2 is 80. So this will become 1 by 2. So 1 by 2 whole raised to power 40 times 40 raised to power 40. Now I just look into both the numbers. Both the number has the same power. So here we will use the same power exponential identity. So we will use this one identity here a times b whole raised to power n which can also be written as a raised to power n times b raised to power n so here these two numbers are in this one form so we will change these two numbers from this form to this one form so this number will become is equal to this will become 1 by 2 times 40 whole raised to power 40 now again we will simplify these two numbers here 2 times 1 is 2 2 times 20 is 40 so this will become 1 times 20 now what is 1 times 20 this is simply 20 and the power is 40 so 20 raised to power 40 is our final answer and value of the above exponential math problem now here we will try to solve this problem using the second method the second approach so in the second approach we will write this problem here now the problem is 40 raised to power 80 divided by 80 raised to power 40 so here in this one step in this one method we will try to make the basis same so for that we will factorize this one base so this number in the numerator will be the same so this will become 40 raised to power 80 divided by 
we can write this 80 as 2 times 40 which is 80 how does to power 40 now again here in the denominator we will use the exponential identity so here we will use this one identity and this will become the numerator will be the same 40 raised to power 80 divided by and we can write this denominator will as 2 raised to power 40 times 40 raised to power 40 now next we can write this number as 40 raised to power 80 divided by 40 raised to power 40 times 1 by this number 2 raised to power 40 now look at two both the numbers in the numerator and denominator both the number has the same base so here we will use the same base exponential identity so we will use this one identity here rs to power n divided by rs to power n which can also be written as rs to power m minus n now using this exponential identity we will write 40 one time and we will subtract their powers so this will become equal to this will become 40 raised to power 80 minus 40 times 1 by 2 raised to power 40 so let's further simplify this equation so this will become 40 raised to power 40 minus 40 is simply 40 times 1 by 2 raised to power 40 we can also write this equation as 40 raised to power 40 divided by 2 raised to power 40 now my just look it to this equation this number here again the power in the numerator and denominator is the same so here we use the same power division identity so here we will use this one identity having same power so we will change that number from this one form to this form so this will become is equal to this will become we will divide the basis 40 divided by 2 hold us to power 40 now 2 times 1 is 2 2 times 20 is 40 so this will become 20 divided by 1 is simply 20 so 20 raised to power 40 so finally 20 raised to power 40 is our answer using the second method now in last if you like this video so don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel for such a more interesting and step-by-step -step math videos thanks for watching